Hey man, how about this video for ASB? Yeah, let's get it in now. It's already week late. This is John Schengler. And I'm Steve Pisano. You know, we went to Archers last year and it was incredible. But we definitely stumbled plenty of times. Like when I told you on the plane that we were missing $900. Yeah, kind of like when we crammed everyone in the van and made them sit on their luggage. But overall, we had done our homework, I think. It all turned out okay, and it was all worth it. It was about reflection <laughs> and having a ton of fun. Yeah, in the end, it was about being a team and becoming active citizens. Hey, active citizens, my name is Frankie, and I was the coordinator for the 2012-2013 school year, along with Megan. Um, I just wanted to reach out to all of you and say congratulations on all of your accomplishments so far, and um, wish you a lot of luck in your futures and I hope that you all take a lot away from the alternative break experience. I know it was one of the best um, things that I did at JMU and it has really impacted my life after college as well and I hope that you all continue to be active citizens in your communities wherever you end up and just enjoy the time you have left in the program. Hey, my name's Alexis and I was one of the AB coordinators from 2010 to 2011. I wanted to congratulate you on your leadership graduation and I hope you have an awesome time on your spring break trip. Uh, one piece of advice is to take everything that you've learned during your leadership trainings and apply that not only to your AB trip but also um, post, you know, post AB. Um, for me, I took ev everything that I've experienced at AB and I took it with me post-graduation and I still currently volunteer at a youth development agency and I also um, work as an IT business analyst um, for CNCS. If you didn't know, CNCS is the government agency that created AmeriCorps. So I'm taking um, all the experiences I had during AB and I'm continuing, continuing um, to move forward with that. So hopefully that happens to you as well. Um, and I really want to congratulate you again and I hope you have an awesome time. Hey everybody, I'm Justin Tarbell. I'm a second year grad student here at JMU. Um, I am a two-time spring break trip leader. Uh, just wanted to wish you all good luck on your trips and just know that you're going to make an amazing difference whatever whatever work you're doing, um, whether it's work that you signed up to do now and then end up doing something completely different or the same work, you're going to make a difference. Um, your trip's going to be a success. Hi, ASB trip leaders. Um, if you don't know me, my name is Andrea Kukoff. I was a trip leader and I was a coordinator for ABP. Um, I'm so happy that Michael and Stacy reached out. I think this is such a cool thing. Um, I'm sure you guys are so excited about your trips. I just wanted to wish you guys the best of luck. You're gonna be amazing. And I just don't think of this trip as the end. Think of it as just the beginning of, this is like a catalyst for everything that you're gonna do. Like after this trip and after you graduate, um, Alternative Break changed my life. It's what made me wanna pursue a career in education and leadership and service. Um, I'm currently a core member of Teach for America in New Orleans, teaching kindergarten. And I'm just so grateful for my AB experience. So my advice to you guys is take it all in, seize every opportunity, put your phones away, like be so in your service and so in your participants and just, you know, journal like, let the experience like take over you because it will seriously change your life. Um, I'm not just saying that. Um, if anybody's coming to New Orleans, please let me know. I would love to like talk to you guys or meet up with you. Hey guys, Katie here. Um, I just want to say that the Alternative Break program is so awesome, especially the one at JMU. Um, and it just opens up your world to so many opportunities and possibilities and you get to give this amazing experience to so many fellow peers and classmates by being a leader um, and you guys are awesome and right now I'm serving in AmeriCorps and Triple C in Joshua Tree California just rock climbed my first huge boulder <laughs> and I wouldn't be here without alternative break experience and it rocks your world and it's incredible and you guys are incredible for doing it and for being leaders so Keep on keeping on. Hey there leaders. You've just been trained to become very capable, active citizens. And what you do on this trip is going to turn out for better or for worse, depending on how you make the situation. But just remember that even well after college, 
This is going to be one of the most valuable experiences that you can learn from, and it's going to take you very far in life. So keep your head up, good luck, and have fun. Hi everyone, my name is Alexa. I was the ASB coordinator last year. Um, congratulations on making it through your training. Y'all are going to have wonderful service trips. I'm so proud of you all. Um, just wanted to say, I'm um, a word of advice. Once you're moving on past your college career, um, follow what makes you happy and don't just jump into something just because you feel rushed. Um, take your time. I'm, I did that because of ASB and I'm now very happy. Um, I'm out doing AmeriCorps and C in the Pacific region. Right now I'm on a four week project in the San Joaquin River Gorge doing trail maintenance and trail building. And um, I love it to so just follow what makes you happy and have an amazing service trip. Good job. Hey y'all, I'm Ryan. I was a coordinator many moons ago. Wanted to share a little something with you. So I've got this necklace here. Uh, it is my mind birth calendar month. I got it in 2010 when I went on my first trip, which literally changed my life. Uh, sounds super cliche, but it's not. I, I really did. Um, I wanted to share really the words and the wisdom that came from this woman in Belize who said something to me that she probably doesn't remember, but I, I will never forget. She said to me to keep your eyes, your mind, and your heart open, and you will see what you need to see. And I've carried this necklace with me. I've taken it off. I've never taken it off since I went on this trip. And I wanted to share those words with you as you all are about to take off on your trips. And to remind you to both as leaders to remember these words, but also for your participants to encourage them to embrace and engage the trip and the most meaningful ways possible. So good luck. I'm excited for all of y'all, even though I've never met you. Hopefully at some point I will. But try to remember to keep your mind, your eyes, your heart open. You will see what you need to see on these trips. And they really do have the power to change people's lives. Congratulations and happy graduation. You all have made it. Everything that you've been doing, all the hard work has been leading up to this moment. And I'm so excited for you all. Um, especially to have the opportunity to learn from and work with and experience um, everything that the community you're going to has to offer. I do want you to remember though that to work alongside community, what we're all hoping for and what you all really know, but implies that it's long term, a lasting commitment, and that this is only a springboard. I really hope that you all don't lose sight of the bigger picture and what's in store. And most of all, you have the most important job um, with helping your participants see and understand what you already know. Have those conversations that week about what next steps you all can be doing while you're there and how you all could be moving and working towards investment in community. Because it's one thing for you all just to know that and walk away with, but it's so much more impactful if you can spread, spread that with your participants while you're already there. So I'm really excited. Again, congratulations. And I know you all will have a great alternative break and a great time. And I can't wait to hear some of the stories that come out of it. Blessings.